He was a man of many trades, but most importantly, Morgan Klein was a hero, a philanthropist with a generous heart. Several friends and colleagues emotionally shared stories at his memorial about the successful X-Line Iowa native who came from humble beginnings and helped revitalize Centerville. Our torch has been lit. And our future is bright for all who today and tomorrow proudly share this place. We, Dan Morgan Klein, come home. Morgan made his fortune as a pharmacist, advertiser, and real estate genius, among other things. He helped save many old buildings and even communities. During his advertising career, he was responsible for the advertising launch of two of the most successful pharmaceutical products of all time, Lipitor and Viagra. Morgan's successful professional career allowed him to donate to numerous causes. As a Drake University alumni, he gave $5 million to a scholarship endowment fund for pharmacy students at the university. He also donated $3 million to Drake University for the construction of the Morgan E. Klein Atrium for Pharmacy and Science. And perhaps the greatest recognition that we as Drake University can bestow upon Morgan on this day is to acknowledge that Morgan's narrative, Morgan's story, is one to which we will refer generations of students, telling them that's our aspiration for you. Go out there and become a Morgan Klein. His donations to the Centerville community include a $1 million donation to Mercy Medical Center for a new wing to be named in his honor, and also a community sports complex, among many other gifts to Centerville. The torch has been passed, and the Centerville community will look to keep Klein's generous legacy alive. I think we now have reached a phase where we need to think uh, not what Morgan can do now, or what plans he's made for us in the future, but we have a challenge of carrying out Morgan's dreams, and I'm sure we can do it with the assistance of all of you at Drake University and uh, the guidance he's left us. Reporting in Centerville, Nate Masulo, KTVO News.